So often patients are declined for a couple different reasons. One is simply the, um, the experience or expertise of the providers at that site and the ability to manage patients, not just during the operation, but after. Uh, as a surgeon, my input for most patients' care is short. It's six hours of work and then, you know, the patient takes over the rest. But really, it's not just me. It's I might do a difficult operation, but then the nurses on the floor have experience with complex sick patients. The respiratory therapists know what we need to get you up and out of bed and breathing well. The um, physical therapists know the limitations that you may have and know how to get you mobilized quicker. So it's really a whole team effort that Keck provides. It's not just me as an individual, it's everybody here putting in the work. And so oftentimes centers who don't have as much experience it's not that the surgeons aren't capable, it's not that individuals aren't invested, it's that the, the full picture, the full program isn't something that's available. So as the surgical arm of the multidisciplinary program, uh, what we really have an expertise in here at Keck is complex surgery for um, advanced malignancies. And that means patients who might have been declined operations at other sites or by other providers, or cases where perhaps patients have received therapy already and there is uncertainty about whether surgery would be an appropriate next step, we're always happy to provide those additional second opinions and often can uh, provide more complicated operations that may not be available at other sites. And so that's something that we do again as a team. There's four of us here who do these operations and for these more complex procedures, you're going to have one, two, three surgeons in there trying to get you the best possible operation, the best possible outcome.